Academic Tryhard is a student who spends a long time in studying at the price of sacrificing meal, sleep, or entertainment time due to the heat competition and high expectation of parents. Numerous students study day and night, wishing to be admitted. I, ju I have just experienced the uh, uh, college entrance exams, uh, so it gave me uh, gave me a deep impression. Um, we all, we just uh, repeated the study review uh, and the exam over and over again, uh, so it gave me a uh, deep impression. Uh, so I think the college uh, entrance exam is uh, so horrible. Um, what made me left a uh, deeply impression is uh, pressure. Um, I have to study hard so that I can get a good grade which can let me enter a good university such as X XMU. So I study all the time. I have been academic try hard. At least I think in my high school, I study uh, very hard. I sacrifice many things. During my high school, I study about 10 hours a day. Maybe, but if, I, if, you, if you want to know, I maybe stay at, at, at school about 14 hours. Before in, the, in the high school, I, I felt I'm dying, but I still uh, keep on trying to achieve my dreams, but and uh, maybe I, I did, and maybe it did, didn't satisfy me, but it's okay. I was like, I need to study, I will feel need to study for every day. If I skip for a day, I feel some uh, like very anxious because I didn't, I feel I didn't did any, anything for that day. Then I feel like I feel very guilty for that whole day. Um, during my secondary school, I normally will study for about one to two hours every day. But now I will read according to my mood. Like if I got mood, then I will read like for about one hours. Or if you count exercise as also study, so maybe uh, two hours, something like that. I feel very tired, yeah, very tired. Like, I always feel like I need to do, I always feel like I need to study, 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 then at the end I feel like, actually it's not worth because you always study then, you feel like you didn't really enjoy your life. Uh, before and after. Um, like, uh, during my secondary school I feel like, a little bit tired because always uh, want to study then you like you cannot do any you must always fill your one to two hours time to read in my free time I always uh, playing the guitar or uh, or watch or working uh, in the uh, playground or um, uh, with my friends uh, go shopping I spend a little time uh, on study after class. Uh, uh, normal than one um, hours, uh, but in my entertainment times, uh, I spend a lot of time. Uh, no less than five hours. Um, uh, I think um, study is important 
uh, but we must uh, pay attention to uh, our entertainment li life, uh, liking um, play playing the guitar and uh, uh, speech or uh, running. I respect them, uh, but I don't, don't agree with them, uh, because uh, we must uh, pay attention to uh, many times on study, uh, but no need to pay uh, um, too much attention on study. Uh, so I think uh, we just uh, uh, pass the exam is okay. Of course, um, such as playing guitar, watching movies, playing soccer and uh, computer games. But I usually study about one hour a day because I usually spend much much more time on entertainment life like computer games and uh, sports and club. I am vice chairman of our school. Chinese Debate Competition Club uh, and we usually hold some uh, competition so I need to so I need some time to deal with something but before quiz or exam I will I will still to study hard in my opinion inter entertainment is the most important thing in college life I don't pay more attention to academic source or GPA. It's good enough to graduate smoothly without failing and failing exams. I think college life in I think college I think college life is not only about academic source and exams. Entertainment life is also an important part of of college life. We can it uh, we can in we can intend device talents and become an all-round person from it. Okay, I will suggest it depends on every individual is different time to study because um every individual, individual they have um mostly la, I will suggest like not more than two hours study then you need a rest or maybe fifteen minutes rest or twenty minutes rest then only if you want to continue then continue but mostly it's about rest if you do because uh one person focus uh, is limited the focusing attention is very limited if more than two hours uh, if you keep on studying, maybe you can't remember at all. So, so every one and a half until two hours, you need a 15 to the, uh, 30 minutes rest. And then, then you only can continue to do your assignment. Uh, if you still continue, that, that is causing a lot of stress. Like, that's the reason quite a lot of try hard students coming to do a stress management because they didn't limit their time on study. They're causing they can't focus and they can't remember at all. So uh, they feel that it's stress. But mostly if you want to study, I encourage. But... Uh, you need a time for yourself as well, especially after one and a half or two hours, you need a rest, like uh, maybe go out for a walk or maybe uh, to do something that you like uh, other than the study. Like, then we're quite good if you want to go back to focus on study again. Um, I got four um, forwards, work hard, play hard. Like I would say that uh, if you want to try hard in your academic, but you need to remember, you need to reward yourself as well. So my word is work hard, play hard. Like. I know you're somewhere out there, somewhere far away. A famous saying suggests life is not all about study, but what can you do if you cannot handle just a part of life? However, for our academic tryhard, do you really know what you are learning in terms of its prospects and functions? Do you know what you are studying for? For your dream, money, for fun, or merely nothing? Do you know sometimes you study outside the library till the midnight just because you didn't work hard previously? Do you know studying all the time does not promise you a bright future because you forget to consider your practical talents? When you are inspired by the former saying, don't forget the first part, life is not all about studying. You have less chance to succeed if you cannot find the balance. Now look around, 
A friendly conversation improves executive functions, including memory and the ability to suppress distractions. Five minutes break gives you a perfect opportunity to remember more in study. Work hard during the days, and you will not miss the happy time on weekend. Study is only a branch of life, but you are in life in whole. Talking to the moon, trying to get to you.